No Country for Old Men and the Road author Cormac McCarthy has died at the age of 89. It has been reported that he died of natural causes. McCarthy died on Tuesday at his home in Santa Fe, New Mexico, his publisher Knopf and his son John McCarthy have confirmed. A statement announced the sad news, which read, Pulitzer Prize winning author Cormac McCarthy died today of natural causes at his home in Santa Fe, New Mexico. He was 89 years old. His death was confirmed by his son, John McCarthy. Our Yorkshire Farms Amanda Owen breaks Instagram silence with family update McCarthy became known as one of the greatest writers in American literary history during his career as an author. The author's most famous novels were Western and apocalyptic themed, with The Road and No Country for Old Men both being adapted into blockbuster Hollywood films. McCarthy's screenplay for The Sunset Limited, based on his 2009 play of the same name, was also made into a film starring Tommy Lee Jones and Samuel L. Jackson. Fellow American author Stephen King took to Twitter to pay tribute to him, writing, Cormac McCarthy, maybe the greatest American novelist of my time, has passed away at 89. Don't miss. Daniela Westbrook slapped by doctor during Nightmare Ordeal, latest, Barry Manilow detailed leaving perfect wife after one year of marriage, insight, Graham Norton breaks silence after marrying filmmaker, comment, he was full of years and created a fine body of work, but I still mourn his passing. McCarthy's work on his novel All the Pretty Horses earned him a National Book Award and a National Book Critics Circle Award. In 2007, he received the coveted Pulitzer Prize for Fiction and was selected by Oprah Winfrey for her book club after releasing post-apocalyptic novel The Road. McCarthy went on to become the second author to receive the Penn Slash Saul Bellow Award for Lifetime Achievement in American Fiction, after Philip Roth also achieved the honor. McCarthy previously opened up on No Country for Old Men becoming a hit movie, which won four Oscars at the 80th Academy Awards, including Best Picture. The author told The Wall Street Journal in 2009 that he had originally wanted to release the story as a screenplay, instead of a book. He revealed he was warned against the idea at the time, and was told, that will never work. Years later I got it out and turned it into a novel. Didn't take long. I was at the Academy Awards with the Coens. They had a table full of awards before the evening was over, sitting there like beer cans. One of the first awards that they got was for Best Screenplay, and Ethan came back and he said to me, Well, I didn't do anything, but I'm keeping it.